Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking that you are not the person we're asking to give during this P4A. You know, I think most of us think, yeah, sure, they asked me to give, I never give, but I watch the videos, and you know, the charity is still there next year, saying they saved lives and need money. But as you consider the fact whether you are or are not the person we're asking right now to part ways with that one dollar, I want to encourage you to reflect on what a charity is supposed to be all about. I think collectively we all believe in charity. We're American. We want to help others. But if you're like me, sometimes you're not sure how, because you know, there's that couple at the park with the clipboard talking about rice, and the guy missing teeth on the street saying God bless, and they ask you to round up at Panda Express, but you're not really sure where the money is going, so you just kind of give up. You want to help, but you just don't want to waste your money. But I'm not here to get you to buy a goat, or some sort of malaria net, or watch a video about an army of tortured children. I'm just here to tell you to give one dollar. That's all. Just give money directly. Now you're thinking, just give money away? They say never to do that. Yeah, but they're probably wrong. There's this entire organization designed out of charities. And you know what they found to be one of the most effective charities? This one. Give directly. They give small amounts of money directly to people in extreme poverty through phones. That's it. They trust them to know how to spend it. Part of charity is learning how to imagine other people complexly. Learning that we and our rarefied societies don't have all the answers. That receivers of charity are real people too, and often smart, thoughtful people just like us. If you lived in the Cote d'Ivoire, would you spend the money on gambling and booze? No. <laughs> Unsurprisingly, neither do they. They buy things they need, like a roof that's made out of more than just hay. The first person I ever got to elect once said, Our values call upon us to care about the lives of people we will never meet. This is a way of showing that care, by trusting them.